I fancy something cheesy. Cathedral City Bites. Cathedral City Bites. Cathedral City. Cathedral City. Cathedral City Bites. Cathedral City Bites. Only 12 minutes in the oven. Cathedral City Bites. 12 minutes in the oven. Cathedral City Bites. Everybody loves Cathedral City Bites. Everybody loves Cathedral City Bites. Everybody loves, everybody loves Cathedral City Bites. Mmm, cheesy. So as you can see, when they come out the oven, even after 11 minutes, not the 12 allotted cooking time, they do tend to explode. A lot of these cheesy things, you put them in the oven and they get overcooked and all the cheese comes oozing out and you're just left with breadcrumbs. So when I'm selecting one for a review, I'm gonna to have to try and pick one that's got some cheese still left in it. They weren't all a disaster, but it was definitely a minute too long. So keep an eye on them during the cooking. There we go, this, one, this one's only had a little bit bubble out the top. Cathedral City, everybody loves a bit of cheese, don't they? And Cathedral City is a very popular brand rather than Supermarket's own brand, and it is usually quite tasty. So these are just a, a gooey, cheesy nugget. Mmm. So it does have a really good cheddary flavour. It's not rubber, it's not tasteless that you might get with some cheaper alternatives. No other brands mentioned, <coughs> Iceland. Um, but these, mm, they are delicious. Where's the packet? I found the packet. Cathedral City Bites. Funny enough, on sale in Iceland. And they do make a nice little alternative. I would say do them a minute or two less in the oven. So it's just like that point of ooziness, but these are gonna get eaten quite happily, hollow or not. Because they're very, very tasty. I must say that these have been in the freezer for about a month and a half. You'll probably see in this video a month after I filmed it. You might not even see it this side of Christmas. And they've been out about a month or two already. I just forgot I had them in the freezer. Mm -hmm.